Hello, I'm Richard Esplin. I'm a solutions engineer with Alfresco Software, and I work with new customers in the Western United States. And I get just a moment to discuss with you five neat tools that Alfresco provides developers. And the first tool is content rules. Alfresco provides a GUI for configuring rules that will be attached to folders. Regardless of, of how content is added, updated, or deleted from the folder, the rules will execute. And the execution of these rules can be filtered based on the type of content, on properties of the content, on who put the content in, and allow you to move the content, manipulate the content. It provides a way to produce simple workflows or simple manipulations of content. The second powerful tool is server-side JavaScript. Alfresco lets you register your own JavaScript with a content rule. And then you can execute your custom code when content is, is manipulated in the repository. This server-side JavaScript can, can manipulate and access the full range of the repository's power. And we also provide a server-side debugger for this JavaScript. Makes it very easy to watch variables, step through your code, see what's happening, which lowers the cost and time of development for your, for your custom JavaScript. The third powerful tool is Aspects. Aspects let you cross-cut the repository to be able to group common pieces, common behaviors, properties, pieces of metadata uh, together and programmatically add or remove it from content. The fourth powerful tool is the Seamus API. This industry standard API allows groups of developers, communities, to build libraries with the tools of their choice. So you can continue to use PHP, Python, .NET, and use these, the Seamus libraries for those languages to manipulate content, add content, and pull content out of Alfresco in an industry standard vendor neutral way. The fifth powerful tool is web scripts. Web scripts let you extend Alfresco's REST APIs in custom ways. You register a small piece of XML that defines the web script and defines the URL that will be your REST endpoint. You register a template that will manipulate the model and produce the result from the call in a REST style. You also upload a piece of JavaScript. And this JavaScript will then access the repository, manipulate your asset, populate the model, and hand it off to the template. These five powerful tools reduce the cost of solving problems that are custom to your business with Alfresco in a well-defined way that keeps your code separate from Core Alfresco. If you have any questions, I'd love to help out. You can contact me in my email.